Hello friends, in this video tutorial we discuss about the bitwise operator. C has a special operator known as bitwise operator for manipulation of data at bit level. These are used for testing the bits or shifting them right or left. Bitwise operator may not be applied to the float or double. This symbol is called the bitwise and operator and uh, I am simple, simply taking example to explain the bitwise operator. So I am declare here a variable a and assign the 60 value into the a and uh, this 60 value I simply convert into the binary format and the binary format of the 60 is 0 0 1 1 1 1 0 and 0. It's very simple to convert any number into the binary format. You simply do this, simply divide the number like 60 by 2 and the, when we divide the 60 by 2, the quantient is 30 and the remainder is 0. You again divide the 30 by 2 and the quantient is 15 and remainder is 0. You again divide the 15 the quantient is 7 and remainder is 1. You again divide the 7 with the 2 and uh, the quantient is 3 and remainder is 1. And uh, again you divide the 3 by 2 then the remainder is 1 and quantient is 1 and at last the remainder is 1 and 0 and 0. This is the bit format binary format of the 60. I am again declare here the variable b as b as a variable and their data type is an int and store the value 13 into the b and convert into the binary format 0 0 0 0 1 1 0 1 okay when I am using here the e bitwise and b the binary format is look like this you simply 0 1 this is the one if any one condition is false then condition is false means if you compare are you pairs 0 1 this is the 0 when 0 and 0 this is the 0 1 and 1 both condition is true then 1 1 and 1 condition is true then 1 1 and 0 1 condition is false so the result is 0 and uh, 1 0 this is 0 1 uh, sorry 0 and 0 this is 0 0 and 0 this is 0 this is the simple binary format of 12 means if simply use the bitwise AND operator with A variable and B variable. This produce the re result as a 12. You simply look here. This is the practical demonstration of the bitwise operator. You simply write here has include stdu.h, has include conio.h, void main, then opening brace and uh, simply declare here the two variable a and b and assign the 60 value into the a and uh, 13 value into the b and printf in the double quote simply write the percentage d double quote close comma in the bracket a bitwise and b bracket close and then function bracket close and then semicolon and then get ch when you write this in id of the c ide of the c integrated development environment of the c this will print the result as a 12 okay and uh, in the next ppt i simply explain the another bitwise operator this is called the bitwise or operator and uh, I am taking previous variable and their values and uh, binary format and I simply write here a equals to 60 and their binary format is 0, 0, 
वन 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 जीरो एंड जीरो एंड वेरिएबल बी एंड असाइन टू द थर्टीन इन टू द बी एंड बाइनरी फॉर्मेट इज जीरो 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 वन वन जीरो वन ओके वेन आई एम यूजिंग द बिट वाइज ऑफ और ऑपरेटर विद ए विद ए एंड बी देन द रिजल्ट इज जीरो जीरो वन 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 जीरो वन मीन्स जीरो वन इफ एनी कंडीशन इज ट्रू देन इट टेक द फन कंडीशन ट्रू मीन्स जीरो वन वन जीरो 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 वन वन बोथ कंडीशन ट्रू इट्स ट्रू वन 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 बोथ कंडीशन ट्रू इट्स वन वन कंडीशन इज ट्रू वन जीरो मीन्स कंडीशन इज ट्रू वन एंड वन जीरो वन जीरो 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 कंडीशन बोथ कंडीशन फॉल्स एंड इन दिस केस ऑल्सो बोथ कंडीशन फॉल्स एंड दिस इज द जीरो एंड दिस इज द बाइनरी फॉर्मेट ऑफ सिक्सटी वन वेन यू प्रैक्टिकली इम्प्लीमेंट दिस एग्जाम्पल सिंपली आई एम राइट हेयर द हैज इंक्लूड एस्टीडियो डॉट एच हैज इंक्लूड कोनियो डॉट एच वाइड मेन ओपनिंग करले प्रेस इंट ए कॉम वी टू वेरिएबल्स डिक्लेयर हेयर एंड एस आई इन द सिक्सटी वैल्यू एज अ ए इन द ए एंड थर्टीन वैल्यू इन टू द बी एंड प्रिंट फंक्शन ब्रैकेट डबल कोट एंड परसेंटेज डी डबल कोट बन कॉम इन द ब्रैकेट ए बिट वाइज or b bracket close and function bracket close and then semicolon this will produce the re result as 61 okay in the next in this ppt i am explaining the left shift operator i am taking here the variable a and uh, the value as a 60 assign into the variable a and the binary format 0011110 and uh, when we write here a left shift 2 in this case this bit wise shift left 2 means 1 come to this position 1 and this one come to this position 1 and uh, the binary format is this 1111000 and uh, this is the binary format of 240 when you implement with the practical then you simply take here the variable a and uh, a equals to 60 and print if in the double quote you simply write the percentage d double quote bun comma bracket a left shift 2 bracket close and function close then semicolon and then get cs this will print the 240 okay in this bit wise operator i explain the right shift operator this symbol is called the right shift operator it shift the bit right i am taking here again the variable a and assign to the 60 and their binary format and when i shift the right shift 2 the binary format is like this this one come to this position and this one come to this position this one come to this position and this one come to this position so the binary format is 0001111 and 1 This is the binary format of fifteen. So when you practically implement this into the i any IDE, then this will print the fifteen. You don't need simply you declare a variable e and assign to the value sixty and print of bracket double quote percentage d double quote bun comma closed comma. You simply uh, within the bracket you simply write here the e right shift 2 bracket close and function bracket close then semicolon gets h okay and uh, 
this program print the result as a 15 okay this is the bitwise operator jaw this symbol is called the bitwise operator jaw i simply taking here the example int e as a 60 and their binary format int b as a 13 and their binary format first you need to understand the jar table summary this is the jar table summary you simply look here e variable b variable 0 1 e jar b as 1 1 0 this is e jar b 1 if the value e0 b0 this is the 0 if the e1 b1 then the e or b is 0 so you simply understand this example 0 1 means 1 0 0 means 0 1 1 means 0 1 1 means 0 1 0 means 1 1 0 means 1 0 0 means 0 and 0 0 0 this is the a jar b and uh, this this is the binary format of 49 so you simply take or uh, write this program into the any ide simply you need to declare two variable a and b and assign the value anyone according to your need and in this in the my case i simply assign the 16 to the a 13 into the b and printf and then in the double quote percentage d double quote close comma bracket a jar b bracket close and function close and semicolon get cs this will print the 49 thank you friends please subscribe my channel and uh, like my video thanks for watching my video and uh, thanks a lot